I was shocked by the comments yesterday by Auntie Shockley over Radgar when he referred to Sinn Féin ministers here in the north giving out food boxes and said that we should be ashamed of doing that. And indeed I show no shame in helping people at this time as we face a global health pandemic. I think Auntie Shock was playing politics and I think he's more distracted with formation talks in the south and with Sinn Féin's rise in the last election. I have seen in my role as Minister for Communities over the last few weeks many community activists, many organisations, civic society really pulling together at this time to help one another and delivering essential food for those that are being told to self-isolate for 12 weeks but also those who are on low income who have lost their jobs as a result of this pandemic and who need a helping hand by society and by the community. I've been happy to work with GAA clubs, with Blue Light Services, with community and voluntary sector organisations, with church leaders, with the whole of civic society and other political parties in responding to the need at this time. And I think his comments are shameful because he's saying that all of those people should be ashamed of the work that they're doing. We want to be a society that responds to need within our communities. We want to be a society that protects people, that works in the interests of low income families and for working people. We want to build a society based on equality, based on economic and social justice for all. We're seeing communities really pull together and show a spirit at this time. They're not ashamed of the work they're doing and indeed they're very angry of the comments that Leo has made at this time also. I've been a community activist, I'm rooted in my community. I don't see my community as the poor. I see that as a working class community working together in the interests of everyone and I will continue to do that. I'm not ashamed and if Leo's ashamed then he needs to look at himself.